intent. Uh-huh. Let's yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Bro, how do you stand? <laughs> What's going on? Another episode of Camping Myself the Gents with your Minister of Administration, changing the world one period at a time. And today we have uh, <laughs> Mr. Gazan on the ministerial chair. How are you feeling about period camp, sir? Um, I didn't know it was situated in that area, so I am. Um, I'm not. I'm not okay. <laughs> I'm not okay. <laughs> If you guys could see where this machine is, listen. It, it's not. It's not good. It's you'll not be looking fine. good. I promise you, you'll be fine. But you will, you'll be okay. <laughs> you'll be okay. Let me just pause. Let me just double check something. I need to make sure I put this in a chair. Okay, cool. Alrighty. Cool. So how this is gonna work? I'm gonna ask you a set of personal questions. The personal questions when you're done answering them, you're going to go up two levels. So you see on your device there, that little white thing there, that's there, there's a plus button. You're just going to click twice, right? If I say go up two, okay? Then I'm going to ask you some period questions, some period tri- trivia. If you get those wrong, you're going to go up five levels, okay? If at any point it gets too intense, your safe word is vagina. You can do this. I really wish I was mentally prepared for this. where this machine is. I think I think you'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> I think you you'll be fine. Oh. Or you're gonna if it gets too intense, breathing through the nose, out the mouth works as if you're like having contractions. But what happened? You have, maybe it's gonna be incredible. Maybe it's gonna be a massaging experience. Not there. You'll be fine. <laughs> Question, Nibo. I'm, I'm so sorry for what you guys go through, by the way. If that's where the area you is. You're already apologizing before it's even started. And the thing is, that is like one area. Sometimes we experience it in our back. Um, we'll get the booty pain randomly. I'd rather get the back. Well, get this. Which one would you prefer? Uh, none. Yo, let's try the back. No. <laughs> We are acting as if you have a uterus, okay? Because that's where you'd feel the pain. Lower abdomen. Okay, first question. It's a period question. Okay? Yeah, I thought it was personal. No, we're going first. You see, I You did. Mm. But I said a, a set of personal or period. Gotcha. So it's randomized. Okay. <laughs> and I've said it in a way that if the period questions are too intense, you'll have a personal question afterwards to rest. Okay? Right, so we're on level zero, we're going to start with the period question. What color is normal? I love uh, zero, by the way. I think it's, it's a great level to be on. So it's 40 level. <laughs> <laughs> so, I, I'm loving level zero. You are deflecting from starting. <laughs> Let's start. <laughs> Let's start. Okay, all right. What color is normal for period blood? Is it A, light pink? B, bright red, C, brown, or D, all of the above? I say all of the above. Okay, you're right. You're right, so you stay at level zero. I, lo- I love it, yeah. Okay, great. Now. now we're going to a personal question. Either way you answer it, you're still gonna go to uh, two up uh, levels, so you'll sort of psych yourself up for that. Gotcha. All right, so what made you decide to go on Love Island, and what did you learn about yourself whilst on the show? Okay, so I had no reason not to go. Mm-hmm. Um, there was a lot of reasons to go. Um, okay. I always would have been. I always wanted to see how I would be in a reality show situation type thing. Mm-hmm. And what I learned about myself was, um, I'm great as myself. Okay. Uh, this is something I didn't know. Mm-hmm. Uh, I always had self doubt, you know, and going on a show like that and was able to be myself fully mm. and then seeing my parents reaction because my mm. parents never really saw who I really am right right because um, they're very strict so mm. and for them for me to open myself up like that and then for them to see it and still receive it the way they did that's, right. what, that's what I learned about myself that I'm pretty okay yeah, yeah. and you, you you did really well I think you were very like you brought a different energy to the villa where it was like you were just very I 
a lot of energy. I feel like you need to divert that energy to ESCOM. But I think <laughs> that's one thing I appreciated about your time because you don't have to deviate from being someone else. Mm. You're truly you. And I think sometimes with reality shows, they will either produce certain scenarios where you're not yourself, so you were authentic. Uh, and that was great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think that was my number one focus was I remain true to myself mm. and there's a lot of things that I did there that, yes. <laughs> that I wouldn't have done if I wasn't thinking about of course I must be completely myself and this is, just comes with the show, it's the show. <laughs> all right level two let's go up one two just click the plus button <laughs> question three personal question was just one level two how do you handle the pressure of being in the public eye I wouldn't say there's any pressure really um, I don't feel like I am in the public eye, mm. even though I am, mm -hmm. it doesn't feel like I am. Most days I'm at home, most days I'm just chill, home, rugby, mm. uh, I have a very set life and it doesn't feel like I'm exposed to anything like that. The only times mm. I might feel the pressure is if I have to go to a certain event, have sure. to do a certain appearance, but other than that, for the most part, nah, I'm, I'm still private. I would have thought that being the winner, mm. you would have come, there would have been like some form of marketing obligations and then with that, there's a lot of pressure of like, you know, being the winner of Love Island and a reputational thing, so you don't feel that at all, you're mm. still yourself, you're still doing the same thing, that's incredible. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty chilled. Like, uh -huh. Yeah, it's, it's, it's very easy to, for me to mm. remain myself fully. Okay. I mean, the friends I still have are friends I, I've known since... I was seven years old. Oh wow! So, yeah, I never really went into the industry like mm. that and be like, oh, I've got now I've got to change. Now I've got this. That's incredible. Um, yeah. So most of my circle are people that have known me since way back. Okay, that's incredible. Let's go up two levels. Uh, press the plus button twice for me over there. But we One. Go up two levels. Yeah. Every personal One. question. Two. two. There we go. Level four. All right. Period question. If you get it wrong, we go up five levels. Alright, <clears throat> what actually causes cramps, menstrual cramps? What actually causes menstrual cramps? Is it A, progesterone, okay. B... What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, you thought, you thought it was going to be A, walk in the park. Wait, wait, what was the word? Progesterone. Are you allowed to explain what it is? Yeah, it's a female hormone. Okay. Yeah, okay. B, Paris gladdens. C, estrogen, or D, the luteinizing hormone? Mm -hmm. I make it easy choose. This is so tricky because there's an answer for me, but it's because it's the only thing I know in the whole list you said. And I know the reason for periods. Uh. And the hormone I'm thinking of. Mm. Okay. What? Just what's your first instinct? I wonder. Okay, can I give you both? Mm -mm, I just want one. Okay, I'm saying C, but I want to say B, but I'm saying C. Go up five. Mm. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. You're on level nine. Okay. That's that's a lot of counting. Yeah, yeah. It's prostaglandins, which is B. Was that B? Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. What made you go with uh, C? Because I would have hated myself if the answer was C. Estrogen. Yes. <laughs> okay. So I would have really hated myself. <laughs> but the, the Gladden's part it sounds very familiar. Mm. Um, yeah, so that's why my, my mind was saying B, but my heart was saying C. Oh, it's just. Your instincts, trust your instincts. Both of them said. Uh, okay, you were, you were conflicted. All right, personal question to let you rest at level nine. Do you think the material pressures that we see play out in society in terms of the cars that we drive, the clothes that we wear, etc., have a negative or positive impact on relationships? On relationships? Mm. Um, geez, <laughs> you might be asking the wrong guy because I'm very. Chilled. What watch are you rocking there? This is uh, this is from Stones. Mm -hmm. yeah, I'm in the shoes. It was a gift she from Stones. I call these my Shein twelves. Oh, <laughs> I, I was told it was Shein. Yeah, it is Shein. Okay, yeah. 
Mm-hmm. Like my shit in twelve. So that's what I call it. Mm-hmm. Right so now. you don't feel like there's any form of pressure to like look a certain way and then have that assimilated into our I mean, I think I think there is. Mm-hmm. Um, I don't know if it's negative or positive. It depends on the person, to be honest. Sure. Um, for me, it, it, I don't feel the pressure. Mm. And if I did, I think it would be positive more than anything. Okay. Yeah. So I think I'll keep it there. Mm. It can be negative. It can be both. It can be both. It, yeah. It, it can be both, but by the time I'm, mm. yeah, I don't see the pressure. Yeah. Let's go up two levels. I see this is the pressure I feel. 10, 11. All right. You're on level, level 11. Remember, there's 40 levels. So. I put my leg straight and yes. I died. <laughs> I'm just letting you go. So, this is why you're like this. Because yeah. you're like, it's patrolling. I don't it's know. Controlling the pressure. What? Muscle movement. Yes, yes. But that was not good. Okay, so you feel, don't worry, nothing will happen to you. You will not end up in hospital. You'll be okay. Everything is fine. But people do end up in hospital. Because of menstrual cramps. Yes, yes definitely. So. But you, in terms of this simulation, will be fine. <laughs> I assure you. We've got a period question. Cool. All right. <laughs> what do clots in menstrual blood mean? I'm giving you different answers. Right? Is it eggs, infection, heavy flow, or dehydration? I know what it's not. What is what? What, what do clots mean? I don't want that. <laughs> Give me the answer. You said dehydration. Mm-hmm. That's that's D. What was A? A was eggs. Uh, what's C? C was an infection. What's B? A heavy flow. Who? Who? <laughs> uh, Are you saying who was the pain or? No 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 no. Mm-hmm. What did you say? B is? <laughs> you got me. Okay, B is an infection. No, okay, C. You see, you're, you're mixing them up now. Eggs. No, heavy flow. eggs was A. Eggs was A. Heavy flow? Heavy flow was D. Dehydration, heavy flow. Infection. I want to say heavy flow. You're right. Yeah. Definitely so, heavy flow. You know, yeah. And you have nothing to be worried about if you do see clots, unless they are larger than a, a five round coin. If you do see clots that are larger than that, then please cut the cameras and see a doctor. All right, personal question. You're still on level 11. This is great. I'm happy for you. you your face is saying otherwise. I'm oh, happy for you. Level 16. <laughs> what's, what's what? <laughs> you look like I'm trying to. Okay, we do have two period questions left, so let's see if you can answer them right. All right, so personal question. Emma describes you as a hopeless romantic looking for love in hopeless places. List the top five places, list the worst top five places in South Africa to find love. The worst. Don't say the streets. I mean, that doesn't help. But the worst, the worst in South Africa. Not the world, South Africa. Places as in cities. Or, I mean, the, I'm sorry, yeah. but when it comes to love, I don't feel like there's a bad place too. Really? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I'll just list places that I... I not even I, I, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, <laughs> you're both, you're there, and now you're your face. That's so funny. Mm. Um, yeah, I'm just going to list places I, I wouldn't like finding love at. Yeah. Um, the club. Okay. Gym. G- gym? Okay. Uh, no, gym is for gym. Oh. Um, oh, yeah. Top five places. Family reunion. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Because chances they could be your cousin, could be your, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Right, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, geez, top five places. But as a hopeless romantic, I just feel like you can find love. Anyway. Anyway, literally. So prison, in a cult, yeah, uh, home affairs, um, um, church. Church? Because it makes it look like your intentions were for that. Okay. Even though, you know, yeah. Okay. And then, um, 
Yeah, I'll go to prison. I did. I, that didn't <clears throat> slip my mind. So, Ooh, maybe. Yeah. Hmm. Work. Work. Yeah. So work. the boundaries they can be mm -hmm. weird. So explain the club one to me. Yeah. Why would you not want to find love in a club? Because it's the, it's the music loud. No, you can hear. Yeah, exactly. You be like. I'm looking at you, you look great. And, and they might assume you're a club person. What if they like you because of that? Mm. You know? Mm. And then, yeah, that's all to be honest. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I personally think the club is just too loud. How are we going to have a meaningful conversation to get to know each other? It's really just physical attraction. And for me, that's not enough. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. I, I, but you can't find love in the club. I find love at the gym also nah how do you it's unless I'm, I'm the one you know, being, you know it's unless i'm the one being approached i'd never approach someone that okay way. yeah no it is people when guys do approach in the gym i won't lie i won't lie up to you let's go really? to level 13. did yeah. i get it wrong no no no. we said personal questions after you answer you go up to levels okay level 13. all right so now we've got a period question all right which are the which of the following items are not a menstrual I, uh, product? Is it A, a cervical plug, B, a C sponge, C, a period underwear, or D, a disc? What was the first one? A cervical what? A cervical plug. B, a C sponge, C, period underwear. Or D, the disc. I'm going with B. Go up five. Uh, I'll take it. <laughs> I don't know what a disc is. That's all I know. Go up five. I know disc is D, but. Okay. Yeah. What? Are you pressing the button? No, 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 I haven't pressed mm -hmm. it. I'll tell you when I'm pressing okay. it. Okay. Uh huh. Okay, got it. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Two, yeah. Three, four. Uh huh. Okay, level, what are we on? Level six? 18. 18, thank you. So it is actually a cervical plug that is not a menstrual yeah, product. Yeah, that just sounded weird. A C sponge is a menstrual product that you can find in America, period underwear, yes, and a menstrual disc, disc is one as well. Yeah, yes. like a cervical plug just sounded so It sounds so weird, weird, but it is a product, but it's not for menstruation. <laughs> hey, I don't know. It's like, what? I don't know. All right. Second last question, which is a period question as well. Okay. The period starts when which hormone drops? Estrogen? <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just laughing at you because you're just killing me with your reactions. You're literally killing me with your reactions. Estrogen? Is this, is this common knowledge? Well, it should be. Okay. We go through hormonal fluctuations, so I you should that. know. You should know. All right. Estrogen, the follicle stimulating hormone, progesterone, or the lutein luteinizing hormone. And you're an athlete. You know these things, isn't it? Hormones. <laughs> what are the last two? Progesterone or luteinizing hormone. The follicle one. What's the name of that? Follicle stimulating hormone, FSH. Okay, last two again. <laughs> Progesterone and luteinizing hormone. <laughs> These things are hard to pronounce. <clears throat> I'm going for progesterone. Mm, go up five. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. One, two, three, four, five. 18 plus five. How many 23. levels? One, twenty-three. How are you feeling in level twenty-three? I feel good. You feel good? Yeah. Really? Yeah. When you're complaining about your leg? I haven't straightened it out. Okay, all right. Yeah. Well, we reached the end. And <laughs> for reaching the end, we're going to take you up to level forty. I will. So I have to go. To yeah, you do. I like, just, I just don't put that in the front. No, no matter what happens. No matter what happens. For how long do I stay there? But you have to do 20 squats at level 40. No ways. Yeah. 
Let's take it to level 40. No way. No way. No way. No way. As I'm telling you, up to level 40, if it gets too intense, remember your safe word. Wait, okay? wait, 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 wait. <laughs> 20 squats? Yes. Uh, we can do it with the assisted bench. The assisted just up. Wait, what are the 20 squats for? To, to check, to check, you know, like. Can I function? Can you function? Because we every month have to go to work, we have to go to school, we have to get up out of bed. Can, can I go to school? Squats. Some girls miss out on school. Of course. Of, their period. of level 40. I mean, it varies, right? 20 squats. You're overthinking this. Let's do it. Can I do 24. Mm-hmm. 25. Yeah. 26. Yes. 27. Mm-hmm. Your leg is twitching, yes? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Do not have a rugby match score. The 30. will be fine. A few moments later. Oh. Oh. Okay, let's go. Mm-hmm. Let's go. We're going. 33, We're going. yeah. 34. Oh, okay. 35. 30. Oh. Uh-huh. 36. <sighs> 37. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Wait, okay, wait, okay, okay. I've torn this quad. No, you're not. Okay, I have. I okay. Swear, I swear my life. Okay. I've torn it okay. Before. I'm just letting you know. It's 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 a lecture new. It's not permanent. What are we on? We're on 35, 36. It's I swear it's 37. We keep going until the dot starts blinking. That's when okay. I know we're at level 40. Okay. Uh-huh. Yes. <sighs> mm-hmm. That's not a good feeling right there. Mm-hmm. Welcome to our world. No, that's those are my injuries. Okay. Like just chatting. Okay, <laughs> welcome to our world. Let's go, let's go. Am I the first athlete yeah? I think so. Yeah, yeah, well, and it's good really athletes. You know what? Keep going. Athletes are meant to be, isn't it? No. Come on, let's go. No, no. Be like I'm I'm encouraging you. What am I? Do this. I don't know. Let's just keep going until the dark starts blinking. Bro, things are moving. Yeah. Oh, okay. God. Do you want okay, to wait. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. That's forty. Mm. It hasn't stopped blinking. Keep going. Yeah, that's forty. Sharp. Oh. Shock. Let's go. Come on. I've never had to motivate an athlete to do squats. Well, my... Whilst experiencing period pain. Let's let's just think about this. Come okay. on. Let's go. The things. My... You're overthinking it. Okay. Just stand up. Let's just start off with standing up. Let's just let's just start off with standing up. I don't think I can stand That's all. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm sorry to to be this person. There we go. Do you need assistance? I don't know. I don't know what I need. Um, I feel like you just yeah, it, it just just it, yeah. My feet are numb as well. <laughs> that's the thing that's going on. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Bro, how do you stand? <laughs> What's going on? Okay. Okay. I think I'm right. Let's go. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> how low? I am low, you can go. That's so funny. Oh yeah. Yeah? Oh yeah. Fuck. Oh yeah. yeah. That's a good squat right there. Okay. Woo! Do you think you can do another one? Uh, I think I can. I okay, think let's I can. go. Yeah. Oh, that's not nice. <laughs> what's what's that? What's going on? <laughs> Ouch. Oh, okay, wait, there's like a burning thing. Yeah. I don't know what's going yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. Ouch. Ooh. Okay, wait. Let me get used to that pain. Yeah. All right. I'm just trying to understand my anatomy right now, my body anatomy, and what's going on. That that's what you gotta do when you exercise. Just think about. I feel like what part is being activated. Fitness with Levo. Let's oh, go. yes. What are we on now? Do you want to do you want to try and do ten? Okay, let's try to get to five. Okay. I think mean, we can get to five. All right, all right. Okay. I just need to get used to that. Sure. That pain. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, oh, yeah. Let's go. Three. Oh. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Four. Let's Ouch. go. Ouch. And five. 
Oh, oh. And six. Oh, that's and not seven. a good feeling right there. And eight. <laughs> and nine. <sighs> and ten. Oh, yeah. Take a seat. Are you sure? Yeah. That's not, that's not, no. What's going on? Take bro? a seat. What's going on with that guy? All right, let's take a seat. I'm gonna sit down like Ellen DeGeneres. <laughs> oh, yeah. Who? How does level 40 feel? There's, there's literally, it pinches so hard. Yeah. And I don't like being pinched. Mm. Um, Do you think you'd be able to live with this type of pain? Like once a month for seven days straight? Oh, I really know I can't. Okay. Yeah. So you at least sympathize with people? Right? I always have. Okay. I, I, I did this to dedicate to everyone that I Love said, it. I wish In I could memory. take your pain. Yes. Final I'm thoughts? gonna take it today. Final thoughts about period pain? I think we should do this. Like, when our person is in pain. Sure. And then seven days a month, not. Mm. You should disappear, you should be supportive, you should be caring. Show help where you can. Or just wear the simulator. True, yeah. You could do that as well. Yeah. Just go through it together. Yeah. Mm. No, you did really well. You did really well. We had a very wholesome conversation. You did the squats incredibly well. Thank you. Form was great. Appreciate that. You know? Congratulations okay. for experiencing period pain. To the audience, please let us know what you think about Livo and his squats and basically the entire episode. And if there's anyone else you'd want to experience period pain, please comment down below. Hit that notification bell and the subscribe button so you know when the next family meeting will be. Bye. Wait.